What's up guys, it's Phantom here today with pretty much a, I would say, trailer review and a trailer kind of, you no know, talks on the new Logan movie trailer. And by God, this was one hell of a trailer. And of course, it starts off with giving us a little bit of a lighthearted humor that we see. And it really does portray that. Like, yeah, this movie's gonna be pretty much the depressing kind of emotional drama filled movie, but it will have its humor. And that's how every X-Men movie is. And the first thing we have to do is get to see is little Laura or X-23 actually stealing chips and like these Pringles in this one energy drink. And you know the cashier's like, no, you gotta pay for that. And she just flips him over, but about to kill him until Logan's like, look, stay in control. That's essentially what he's doing. He's trying to keep, that's what this movie's really gonna be probably about, is staying in control. But we see that Wolverine becomes a straight up savage in this movie. There is nothing in this trailer that wasn't savage like even them just talking was savage a lot of the thing is this thing really reminds me of the last of us too or the last of us just the last of us let me explain why in the last of us the it's like you see these two people but then you see like wolverine he's maybe a broken man but he's still wanting to fight and he him and um x-23 are gonna pretty much start a family in a way now, again, we pretty much know who the villain is. I don't remember what his name is, but I made a video, and I'll link it down in the description below on who the vid villain has been confirmed to be. And we see that he is literally trying to get Lori. He's like, I need the girl. You know, Logan's like, what girl? And he attacks him, and by God, Logan, you fucking savage. I love you. I love you. <laughs> like, Hugh Jackman is gonna, for this to be his last from you know you're gonna go all out. Now, one of my predictions that I do have that will happen in this movie is I honestly feel like Wolverine might die, like, we see that he's barely holding on to the thread of a lot of things, and, you know, him protecting Laura and trying to make her, you know, be a normal human being, or at least a decent human being, and surviving is his main goal, and all I gotta say is I can't wait to really see it, and the thing is, with this trailer, I have to admit, it has a lot of action and dynamics in it, and Honestly, X-23 might be one of my favorite characters in this whole entire X-Men franchise right now. Just seeing how she's a little bit comic accurate. And here's the thing, you can't really say comic accurate for one reason. She debuted in a cartoon, so they really got that part in there because guess what? She just, she's savage. She jumps on the hood of a car and it's ready to kill. Like, nobody can stop her and the thing is, the reason why, is because she's X-23 of course and not just that. Being the clone of Wolverine. Now, here's the thing. Another prediction I really have is that Patrick Stewart, Professor Xavier, will die. Like, this isn't even really a theory, but we already see him. Like, he's aging. He can't do all he can do. Not just that, but in some parts of the trailer, we just see that it's X-23 and Logan. Like, no Professor X. So, you know, that much is happening. But, overall, I'm really impressed by this. Fox, keep doing what you do. And I should make a breakdown video by tomorrow. If I decide to, I don't know. But yeah, if you guys like this channel, please hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to check out my other video. I'll leave them down on the side right there. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.